The SEM Rush Authority Score can be a little bit confusing at first if you don't quite understand what all goes into it. So I'll explain exactly how they calculate the Authority Score so that you can better understand what it is and how to use it. <clears throat> so first of all, when you're in SEM Rush, and if you don't already have an account, I'll leave a link below where you can get signed up for a free account so you can use all these tools. Uh, but once you're in your account, You'll be able to, you know, there's different ways to add, but basically from the domain overview, you'll be able to add in a domain of your choice, whether it be your domain or the domain of another company. For this example, we'll just use eBay. Um, but once you put a domain in here, it's going to give you the domain's authority score. And so you might think, all right, 92, but what does that mean? Well, first of all, the authority score is out of 100, so 0 to 100, 0 being the lowest, 100 being the highest, which is like Google, right? Like the most trafficked, authoritative, linked to site on the internet, uh, Google, Facebook, YouTube, those types of sites. And eBay is up there, so we're looking at eBay right now. It's got a score of 92, which, you know, that's pretty high. <laughs> uh, and the reason why is if we take a look at what is going into the calculation of the authority score, there's a number of different elements that they look at. So first of all, they use machine learning algorithms to go scan the internet and find the most trustworthy domains on the internet. And then they use a, a tool similar to Google PageRank to then look at all these different factors, their backlinks, the quality of those backlinks, total number of backlinks, refer IPs, all that different stuff, um, how many links they're gaining and losing in a given period of time, it takes all that data into account. And then at the beginning of each month, it gives each domain an authority score. And it's all relative to the other domains in the same range of authority score. So it's not <clears throat> like domain authority and page authority are pretty well known in uh, digital marketing and SEO. But a lot of these tools have started developing their own calculations internally because they don't have access to that algorithm, Google's PageRank algorithm. Obviously, well, Google's the only one that has access to that. And so they're trying to more or less mimic what Google's PageRank algorithm is outputting, if you want to think of it that way. So when you go and look at the authority score, you'll be able to see uh, <clears throat> what it looks like. Like if you're trying to get backlinks from a website with an authority score of zero or one or two, then that means when you get a backlink from that site, it's not really going to help you out much because it's not passing any authority onto your website. Whereas if you were to get backlinks from eBay and you know all sorts of other high authority websites, I don't know that eBay is the best example because it's an e-commerce site, but um, either way, you know, a backlink from eBay would be more beneficial than a backlink from, from some random website that has a zero domain authority. So that's a summation of how authority score works in SEMrush. If there's anything you did have questions about, don't hesitate to reach out. You can just drop your questions in the comment section below, and I'll be sure to get back to them there. Look, if you're the type of person that just doesn't even want to deal with your online marketing anymore, <laughs> and you'd rather just hand it over and have somebody take care of it for you. Or if you really just want to talk to somebody and get some pointers, um, let's connect. I do offer consulting. I have different uh, services I can offer to help you grow your business through digital marketing. But yeah, feel free to check out my website. You can come on over to TravisWilkie.com. Here's how to spell it because it's kind of funky. Uh, but you can come check out some case studies, see the results I've been able to get for my clients over the years and uh, if you're interested we can connect i'd love to help you out if you can't tell i love helping business owners grow especially when it comes to digital marketing so all right i'll talk to you soon take care